Sometimes when the worries of the world find themselves resting upon my shoulders, I find myself standing amidst the regenerative power of nature. This year, 2020, has been a trying year for us all. And yet the natural world continues on as it always has, unaware of the problems that we face as a human race. I find peace in the quiet and tranquility of nature, listening to the sounds of the birds across the marshes, the feeling of crisp cold air upon my face, and slowing down the rhythm of my fast-paced life to simply sit and to watch. To watch as mallards, buffleheads, and even American coots prepare themselves for the coming winter ahead. And to watch as an eagle soars above, gracefully, and yet powerfully it demands the attention of all as it circles the marsh below. There's something awe-inspiring in the way an eagle flies, gracefully beating its wings as if it's tuned into the very heartbeat of Mother Nature herself. Each stroke of the wing seems to restore a part of me that was lost amidst the hustle and bustle of life, and I find myself that much more in tune with nature. Slowly, as I get lost in the moment, I suddenly hear a new sound. The sound of peace and calm coming from within my own heart and mind. And as the last of the light fades, waves of thunder swans arrive, circling overhead with their distinctive whistling calls. Watching them arrive is nothing short of mesmerizing. The way they fly in formation, instinctively spaced close together and yet apart, but conscious of each other's movements and flight as if they are together as one. Something we could learn from in this year of uncertainty. There is a power in the force of nature, an unseen hand that guides the very instincts of life. We are too often disconnected from it, unable to feel her regenerative power. What if some of the anxiety of life or the polarization that has become ever present in today's society could be healed by simply spending time in nature? What if mankind took a moment out of each day to revel in the beauty and marvels of nature? What would this world look like tomorrow if we all began to reconnect to the very essence of the wild and the language of our environment? I guarantee you that this world would begin to heal as more and more people begin to rediscover the value of nature. balance can be restored, and the hearts of mankind would then grow warm as we learn to live in harmony with the very pulse of this planet. Year after year, season after season, we as a people would then be proud of the earth we call home, of the oasis that life provides through the ability to simply listen to what nature has to tell us. So as we go about our ways, and as we continue to face and overcome new challenges, let us remember to stop and listen to what nature has to say. Because let me tell you, when you do, she will restore your soul and become the friend 
you never knew you had.